Welcome to Cancer Questions with Dana-Farber Cancer Institute. I'm Christina Conti, the Nutrition Coordinator in the Zakem Center for Integrative Therapies and Healthy Living. Today's question is, do processed foods cause cancer? Let's start by defining the term processed food, which simply means food that is changed from its natural state. This includes any change, like washing, cutting, blanching, and freezing. That means many foods in the grocery store, even fresh vegetables and fruits, technically are processed. That might be different from what you're thinking when you hear processed foods. Things like sugary cereal, convenience style snacks, and frozen or prepackaged meals may come to mind. These foods are more accurately defined as highly or ultra processed foods and typically have a longer list of ingredients that include things like added sugar, sodium, and fat, along with artificial colors, flavorings, and preservatives. It's not true to say these foods alone cause cancer, but research does suggest that eating ultra-processed foods on a regular basis can lead to a higher risk of health problems. What matters is your overall eating pattern, not just the occasional packaged snack. And generally speaking, the goal is to limit ultra-processed foods whenever possible and choose vegetables, fruits, whole grains, and lean proteins on a regular basis. 